Is that the new Dragon Master skin or fan made art? It's actually a Riot art. Uh, but here, you can do it. Oh, I'm against Nasus. I'm really happy to play against Nasus. Okay, I'm gonna go TP Ignite against Nasus. I'm gonna go unflinching Demolish. You don't have to go Demolish in this matchup. It's not necessary. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm greedy. Ah, so I should agree. I'm an oinker. But I have the boys with me. Get him! We have Ash, we can win this if you play front to back. I can't even help. I can help him once you get like here or something. You yep, got one. Get him! Oh, we actually just win this hard. Ash is probably one of the most broken champions of a one shot. Dude, it's not even fair. It's not even a fair matchup now. I'm starting the game 3 0. It's, like, it's not even funny, chat. I'm starting 3 0. Do I not buy items? Oh, I'm not gonna buy items. Fuck it, chat. I'm not buying items. I'm gonna show you guys how to win this matchup. Fuck it, I'm not buying items. I do this for you. I forgot to sustain. I'm buying a potion at least, okay? Because I forgot to sustain to full. I'm gonna show you guys how to play this matchup fairly. For level 1, you're gonna wanna do the classic chat. The 3 vital proc. Here, I can't do the 3 vital proc, so I'm gonna wait till I get a front vital. Maybe if I can yoink a back vital here, that'd be good. Like that. Okay, good. Now, now I'm not gonna I'm not gonna auto this vital. Even though it's tempting, I'm not gonna auto it. I'm gonna wait for my Q. I'm gonna do three vital proc combo. Three vital proc. Auto. Auto Q. And as I'm going away, auto. He kind of spaced it from me. That's fine. Now I can do it again. Zone him from XP as much as I can. He's gonna lose this melee here. Auto. Short trade. Punish him as much as I can early game. Literally as much as you fucking can. Good thing he made a mistake. He's pushing in early against Fiora, which is bad. But even if they don't push in early, you can get a cheater recall, right? Last it. Ah, I almost parried it. Had I parried that, that's right. He's just dead there, by the way. I almost predicted his W. Because one thing as well against Nasus is that if you predict Nasus W, it becomes very hard for Nasus to play. Because if you predict Nasus W, you can get so much damage off on him. And he would have been dead there, for example. No, no. So he recalling a TP. I don't have TP, so I'm kind of fucked for that. But it's okay. I'm sure you guys, even if it's an advantage, I'll use it. You'll abuse it on next recall, or I won't. I'm going to buy only enough gold that I had to buy. So here I'm just going to buy, like, what? Long short? And, I guess, boots. Because I had 800 gold. Nope, I can't buy boots. Not allowed. I'm going to buy a long short refillable. Would that be better if you play PTA? No, because later on you're gonna walk calm. Here, the situation I, I, I'm supposed to simulate is uh, me walking back to lane after a cheater recall and playing on the bounce back. Even though here it's a bit cringe because we didn't simulate it naturally, so he has a bigger wave than normal. But it's fine, I'll play it nonetheless. Why are you buying? Uh, cause I'll explain later. I'm making it fair because I started the game with three kills. It's not fair if I just start the game with three kills. And now on this, see, I parried this slow. I parried this slow. You see how I, I predicted his slow chat, and now he's fucked. I, I don't need Diego to kill here. I literally don't need Diego. He was dead regardless. Like, he was dead here regardless, chat. You see, I predict one slow on a bounce back and it's over. And they'll usually do it like a, f a little bit after you engage. So usually I do like Q auto and then I, uh, and then I parry. You see what I mean, chat? So now I'm gonna keep this freeze and perpetually keep it. You can also ask your jungler, hey, give me one early gank against Nasus and it helps me a lot, right? Nasus well, also got some XP from kills. Yeah, so like, I don't even, like, it's not even like big health, you know? Maybe he got, I don't know if he, yeah, he got maybe one like, kill of XP when he, whenever he was dead. But, um, yeah, there isn't a big difference here. I didn't buy any items, I started with low health. I made it as fair as possible. So here, so now here I keep the freeze shot. Parry now. I might have failed it. Happens. But as long as I zone him from the wave, I'm fine. And just keep doing this chat. Why can't you just- Nasus cannot fight you early game. It's really impossible for Nasus to fight you. Right? If you guys do this against Nasus, how does he play the game? He needs jungle. Without jungle, he cannot play the game. And that's why Nasus is a very jungle dependent matchup. But without jungle interference, you can punish him very hard. Spacing, spacing, back and forth. Denying him XP. I spaced that out on him by, by moving back and forth. And you see I keep the freeze here chat. It's fine to not get the gold here because I'm gonna deny him cannon. Which is worth a lot more in XP. He lost 10, I go back there because I, I, I have to do my job of thinning out the wave. Right? So now I thin out the wave. If it's if it's AP Nasus, you can't beat him like in this way. I guess AP Nasus, you have to you have to go like D shield. I mean you'll see if it's AP, they go Comet or Irie, right? So thin out the wave a bit. But it's still a bit big. And see chat, just keep the fruit and he can't get a single stack. Like, I didn't abuse my advantage. I didn't abuse anything, chat. You see? Those, those of you say that like, this matchup's unplayable. Pay the slow and he's fucked now. You see what I mean, chat? I have no mana, though. He's dead, though. Why can't you guys do this? You see what I mean, chat? 
play for the freeze, go for the all in. Whether the jungle helped me or not, it wouldn't have mattered. And I even started with a disadvantage. I had no ignite, didn't buy the items I had, and also had a uh, had health disadvantage. Now what am I gonna do, chat? I'm not gonna go for the play because play fucks up my tempo. Recall, freeze, and we're chilling. I, so I have to spend up until 900. That's my that's my spending allowance. So if I were to spend up until 900, I can't even buy pickaxe. So I'd go this and double longsword. Yep. This is what I would buy, because I started the game with 900, so I'm not going to spend the extra 900. I'm making it fair, alright? You have to punish hard against Nasus early. Same thing for Kale. Whenever you're against Kale and Nasus, these champions, you have to punish them on every single occasion you have early game. I don't get how you can engage him on bounce back. Well, I can engage him on bounce back because Fjordus is so much stronger than Nasus early. Obviously, he didn't fight in a wave, which is a mistake, right? But the thing is, when he has so many creeps, in a real scenario, he doesn't have that many creeps. In a real scenario, Nasus is not allowed to get that many creeps. Because uh, he has no vital bug. Yeah, he has no vital. It's a bug. That's fine. So now I'm going to thin out the wave and play for the freeze. If I want to be an extra, like, extra annoying, I go for the fruit here. But I can only go for the fruit if it's a close fruit spawn. So I can walk back. Here, it looks like it's a far fruit spawn. Yeah, it's a bit too far. I can't go for it. If it spawned here, here I could take it and go back. But if I take that one, he'll break the freeze. Gotta keep the freeze. See what I'm saying, chat? See what I'm saying? So here, why can I keep the freeze? Parry it. I didn't get the slow off. But good vital puck. I don't need to kill. Because the kill sure is cool. If I kill, it's too greedy. What if there's jungler? Just keep the freeze. And now, whether I kill him or not, he's going to have a massive disadvantage. Now, jungler's coming, so I, I want to get level 8 here. If I can get level 8, I, I, I can... Uh... Oh, he's doing Herald. Never mind. We'll stop, we'll stop him on Herald. Hey, he's stopping Herald because he sees me moving. I keep freeze chat, and now you're like, okay, he recalls and gets items, how can I keep the freeze? Even though I'm not buying items, I'm getting a level advantage, and every level is 600 gold, right, approximately. So even if he has an extra longsword, if I'm able to get a level, I, I, the level's worth more, right? But of course it depends on champions, but the advantage on Fiora is that it's so strong, Fiora's so broken. It's the same thing as Malphite? Yes! Why? Because after recall 2 and recall 3, Malphite fucks you up, so you have to beat Mal Malphite on... For, uh, on no base and on first base. If you can't beat Malphite on, on zero base and on one base, he outscales you and he beats you. Because once Malphite gets Brown Ball Tab Eyes, you're outscaled. Of course, on three, four items, you can beat him. Same thing against Kale as well, right? You want to look for that freeze. And now look how the game's unplayable. I don't even do it. I can play with one hand and win this. One hand? Why? Don't ask it, boss. Don't ask why I'm playing with one hand. All right? A lot of the issues I've noticed that people don't know how strong Fiora is level one. Why not play for plates here? Uh, because I want to get enough gold for my Hydra before I recall. So I have a 900 gold allowance, so I need to get I need to get a bit more gold. So here I could push and then play for plates. Because you want to play for plates when you have your first item. So now I can spend, right? Yeah, now, now, now I can actually spend it. Like I said, 900 gold. I did the math chat, we're good. I'm not going to spend the 900, alright? I'm not going to spend it, because it's cheating. And now look, he's going bot lane. He's teleporting, but it doesn't matter at this point. He's not going to just force plates and he, his damage isn't relevant enough. See chat? His damage doesn't matter. And at one point he's going to have to choose me or the minions. So see here, choose me or the minions. And I, I'm, I'm bashing your turret at the same time. Dance around turrets here and Q like this. Ooh, I auto attacked the minion and my tire mat took aggro. Okay, we got to take a little break then and, and, uh, and sustain a bit. And now back at it. If he wants to attack me, we, we dance around turrets. You see what I mean chat? Now to be fair, I'm not, I'm not tracking jungle. If Nocturne ults me, I'm fucked here, right? Sure, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not really in a, in a threat. I could even kill him here if I wanted to, but... And I just got three plates there. You see? I just got three plates. Hydra first situational? Uh, yes. So, uh, against matchups that are very tight, like Riven, even though I did it last game, but like Riven, uh, Darius... Parry that. I parried his first Q, and now, as long as I get this vital, I can out-sustain him. See, chat? Now, as long as I play my, my ult. Sustain on minions. I can out-sustain him. Ignite to keep Conqueror stacked. Q auto, and he's dead from the ignite. You see how I played that chat? I could have played more aggressive, but I'm showing you like how I play it ideally. As long as I get my old proc off, I'm fine. But if he, if he tries to deny me the old proc, then I'll kite the vital. Now I get, I, I get the full turret, minute 14, and boom, lane is one, right? So simple, yeah, it's simple, but of course you need the mechanics to back it off. But the reason why I don't try to do fast combos is to show you guys that even without the mechanics, it can work as well, if you know what you're doing. For all gems, you can't contest level one. Well, the, the, the thing is, you can contest, so I'll explain. There's no champion you cannot contest level 1. That, that doesn't exist. But there's some champions where if you want to contest, you have to 
you have to wiggle around a bit. You know what I mean, chat? You have to wiggle around. Like Darius, you can contest level one, but you have to wiggle around. You have to test him out. Even Jax, you can contest the Jax, but again, uh, oops, what do you, what do you want? Me bot, please. Me bot, please. Against champions that beat you level one, like Darius uh, and uh, Trundle and Jax, and like Volibear as well, because he's passive. The idea is that you can contest level one if they do a misplay. So you can maybe like do some good spacing and maybe get the prior. You've seen me do it a lot of times, right? Where I get prior level one because I have really I have good spacing. Let's try to parry his E chat. So if his painting, if his paintbrush goes purple, that means he's doing a fear. Or like a CC ability. Purple, purple means CC. That's blue. Purple! Ah, I fucked up. Spacing? He has no mana? He's a viewer chat, so I feel bad. But I'm sorry, even if you're a viewer, it makes you better in the long run. Spacing to bait him in? I'm spacing? I'm holding my Q. Why am I holding my Q chat? <laughs> There's so many tricks in one there. I, I, I did like three tricks in a row chat. Alright, so what were the tricks I did there chat? There's a few tricks I did, I did there. I don't know if you, if you guys can I, I, I identify them. And now we just push. Yeah, I'm kind of, like, the game's already won here, basically. So yeah, I'm gonna push. I'm gonna recall here because I have my Trinity. I don't want to stay with too much gold. And Trinity is a big spike for me. Especially chat, whenever you get your Mythic second, you really want to buy it. Why? Because Mythic second also gives you the Mythic passive because you have an item first. So it's even more stats than initially. So what were the tricks that I did there, chat? There's, there's a few tricks. I want to know if you guys can identify it. QW is CC, yes, but... That's not exactly it. Walk back. So walk back was one thing. I was walked back. I was walking back, but I didn't walk back like this. I walked back straight. Because if you walk back like this, you're feigning aggressive uh, aggressivity. I want to show full passivity by walking entirely back. Because if you do this and this, you're feigning aggressivity. I want to, to make sure fully full passivity. That's one thing. What was the next trick chat? Parry slide for the for the slow. Well, yeah, of course, but of course I'm gonna I'm gonna slow parry. That's not a trick. That's obvious. So here, I, I, I want to just split bot lane here. Honestly, I should maybe go go top lane because there's Drake. Ideally here, I should be top lane. My team's top, so it doesn't matter too much. The rest of this game won't be too educational because I'm so ahead, it doesn't matter anymore. QW then walk to dodge Q. Good, good, good. That's trick number two. That's trick number two. That's trick number two. There's one last trick, but it's like a high elo trick, chat. I, 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 I'm surprised if you guys get it. Holding Q till Vital was not in a better spot. Almost, almost, almost. So Q, trick number two was QW, and then I dodged right after the QW. Why did I wait so long to QW? Why did I wait so long to QW? Can I parry this? Right now. I parried the slow as well. Alright, there's that. Gap close? No, not, not quite, not quite. But if you're actual potentials, yes, that is part of it. That's not the main reason. That's not the main reason. I like this though, because now you guys are you guys are thinking, you guys are cracking the nuts. You guys are like, uh, you know, noggin. You're not like, you're using your, you're using your noggin. You know what I mean? Okay, pur purple means CC. Purple means CC. Purple CC. Ah, well. So okay, I I'll tell you guys a trick because I don't think any of you guys will get it. So the, the third trick and why I held my Q so long is chat, what am I trying to parry against Milio? Obviously, his Q, right? I'm always trying to parry Milio Q. I can't help you, boss. I'm sorry. I'm getting fucked. I can't buy full hole breaker, but if I sell this, I can buy it. Okay, I can buy full hole breaker. Because I said I won't spend the 900 gold. The entire game, I will not spend that extra 900. Oh, I got ca my Q cancelled. I gotta sustain my minions. He's gotta back off because he's removing my hole breaker here. If he keeps removing my hole breaker, I can't fight. I need to figure out how to, st how to stun with W. Uh, well, to stun with W, you have to parry a CC. Like, parry an ability that, that will... If an, if an ability will stun or root you or anything like that, he's gonna, he's gonna instantly... Yeah, he's gonna instantly, uh, uh... W me. I can't even tell you why I'm mean, he's gonna instant W me. I just know it. W now? Ah. Oh. QW that, get the stun off. 
the Q off? Parry it. Stack my Conquer before ulting, and now I can ult. Ah, but he flashes out. A bit of a tough situation now that I'm in. Maybe I can make, I can salvage it. Thing is, now this is ruining my Hellbreaker here, and it's really bad for me. Because I'm losing a lot of resistances here, so my Hellbreaker is gone. He has no slow here, he might have... I'm gonna have to parry this. Chat, what did I just parry there? I'm not even sure you guys noticed, but I just parried. I parried the fear beginning. Like the beginning of the fear. Let's see if he does purple gun, purple gun, purple gun. If he uses purple on me, I, I, I can... Uh, I can go back on him. Ah. Okay, bait him in, marinate him, juice him up. Dodge that. He's going for move speed, he's gonna use purple soon. Ah, I missed the parry though. Gotta walk back a bit. The slow is gonna go off now. He's gonna have parry back. I'm gonna let him slow me. Because if, if I parry the slow, he might back off. But now he will chase. And now... You know, that's a minions boss. He's not dead, fuck! I I want to look at, I, I, want to, I thought it was the main character, chat. I thought it was the main character. I was like, I'm not gonna look at him die. No, I thought it was the main character. And I'm playing like a pig though, I'm greeting a lot here, chat, but I mean, it is what it is. I don't mind getting slowed here, it's fine. But Caitlyn's an issue. Thank you for the Aegis. I appreciate it. Now this is the goat. <laughs> now this is the goat. You just saved me. I was dead there. Oof. Monka. I see you're gonna fear bullying low elo players. They can stop. I'm sorry, Dipak. I'm bullying them. I feel bad though for uh, for stomping him. Osha's on his team. Main account, Fiora. Uh, uh, chat, what do I say? Chat, what do I say to him? Uh, go leaderboard. Look top three. That's all I'm gonna say, chat. That's all I'm gonna say. No. He had a 3 0 lead, clueless. Yeah, I sure used that 3 0 lead, clueless. Clueless emoji. I can tank that, my whole breaker just came back up. Q out, get out of the slow range. I have to parry his Q here. Parry it. Q to the side with move speed. Play with bushes here. He's gonna slow me here. I'm gonna Q, Q to the side. He's gonna hold his Q this time. No, but chat! I can see, no, I'm dumb. My bad. Okay, chat. No, 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 no. Stop laughing! Why are you laughing in chat? No, 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 da, are you laughing? Chat, okay, so like I was one step ahead, but I was actually one step behind, okay? So let me explain, chat, all right? So he probably thought I wasn't maxing W. If he knew I was maxing W, he would have known I have parry. So I was like, he's gonna hold his Q this time, right? But he just bonked, you know what I mean? I could have parried it. I got gap, my bad, chat. All right, chat, I'm spending the 900 gold. Fuck you guys. I want to show you we're ending this game. You want to smile yourself, basically, yeah. He's Emerald, he was right for you and praying. Yeah, get bonked, bonked. Let me explain, let me explain. No, no, but chat, actually, let me explain. Fuck yeah, I'm spending the gold, chat. I don't care anymore. I'm tired of this, all right? It's okay, he's just bad, that's what. Maybe I'm bad, chat. Maybe I'm bad, you know? Maybe I'm bad, I'm just trying to sound smart, chat, you know? Like, what if coaches are all bad, but they just try to sound smart? What if, chat? You never know. Bonk. Bonk, 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 bonk. Oh, prediction. Not really, but. Triple! Give me Penta, give me, give me, give me, give me. I'm sorry, yo. I'm not gonna make this suffering last. Same game by the Algerian Prince once again, thank you, I appreciate it.